<laughs> yeah, dude. I came to Peru on this crazy mission to learn how to mountain climb, and I wanted to find a street dog to be my companion. So on my first day, I bought a couple bags of dog food, and I went around trying to feed dogs. Would you like to go? Oh, it's okay, Mike. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. There's no problem. None of them wanted anything to do with me until I met Wendy. She was just sleeping there, and she kind of slowly got up. Girl, you're a pretty girl. Aww. Hello. Who's the sweetest girl? Hello. Such a good girl. And right away we had a total connection. But of course I'm filming this TV show, so I had to go into this building where she wasn't allowed. And I thought I'd never see her again. But later that night, we went out to a restaurant. And when we came out, Wendy appeared with a whole bunch of friendly dogs. And they all wanted love. It was like she told the dogs that I was cool. We got no food or nothing. This just makes me so happy. It's so cute. Oh my god, look how dirty your hands are. <laughs> so she followed us as we walked back to the hotel. Dude, we've been walking for like 20 minutes. Yeah. When we got to the hotel, I picked her up and snuck her in. Go, 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 go. But we got busted right away by the dude who runs the hotel. I'm really sorry, but dogs are not allowed in the hotel. What if I pay you? A crazy amount of money. I, I, I know, but I cannot break the rules. If we give her a bath and then we bring her down. Okay. Only in the bathroom. Okay. Okay, okay cool. Okay. Thank you so much. I wonder if this is your first bath. Yeah, 100%. That bath water was disgusting. Out here with her. They set up a tent for me to sleep with her outside. Baby! I love you sleeping with the street dog. Alright, love you, baby. Aww. Okay, I love you too. I'll talk to you later. Right, bye bye. She's got her water, her food. You ready for bed, girl? Baby can come and go as she pleases, but she's staying with me. <sighs> I don't know if we slept that great. Definitely not me. <sighs> the very next day, I took her to the vet. <laughs> But she's healthy, yeah? I got her de-fleed, dewormed, vaccinated with every shot. They even spray perfume on her. That's what I'm talking about, girl. And she was just good to go. She's no street dog anymore. Mwah. We started going on these mountain missions. I got my girl with some water, dude. <laughs> like, forget what everyone has said. You're not an asshole. <laughs> Have you ever been up here, girl? You ever been up here? Now we've been living out here in the mountains for like two and a half weeks. I love this dog so much. Oh my God! <laughs> She's already got a flight to LA and like that, I'm gonna make her a service animal. I think I'm gonna buy her a ticket on every airplane I ever get on and bring her virtually everywhere I go for the rest of her life. Because that's my girl. Should we go walkies? Yes, come on girl. Come on girl. You want fucking crazy? Well get ready. I'm here in Peru at what, 14,000 feet of altitude with UFC Hall of Famer Chuck Liddell, Yuka from the Dudesons, Olympic medalist Gus Kenworthy, and the world famous Chachi Gonzalez. Why are we here? To climb a 20,000 foot fucking mountain that looks exactly like a titty. We're going full nippage. See, this show is on YouTube Red. What does it mean if you subscribe to YouTube Red? All the ads disappear and you get the best television show ever filmed. Ready? 
We're ready. ready. Oh yeah, and you can might need stitches. You idiot! Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go to the doctor now. <laughs>